Hello, this is Richard, and today is the thirty-four, thirty-five day that I practice Tagalog. Um, I my feeling now is that, uh, when I pronounce those Tagalog words or sentences, uh, I feel more familiar. Uh, I mean my muscle, my tongue is more familiar on those pronunciation. But in real life, when I hear Tagalog, it's still like maybe only twenty percent I understand it. Yeah, but I I believe that day to day, uh, just like the babies learn how to speak to talk, at least they need six months. So I believe I'm the same. I will. I'm the same. I will try to keep uploading. Those videos daily, um, I maybe after six months I can start to speak. Okay, it's a experiment. Okay, so let's start. Okay, today's topic is uh shopping, and there are more a lot of phrases and sentences about shopping. So that's very practical. Maybe I can memorize some of them. Okay, the first word.、Uh, no, the first sentence is. Bumili gamit ang credit card. Bumili gamit ng credit card. Buy with a credit card. Bumili gamit ang credit card. Okay. Bubong. Bubong is credit card number. Bubong credit card number. Next one. Recibo sa pamimili. Recibo sa pamimili. Recibo sa pamimili. Next one. Recibo ng hotel. Recibo ng hotel. Okay, next one. Ice skating. What? Ice skating. Ice skating. I don't know what is she talking about, but here the English is say, I don't need a receipt. Hindi ko kailangan ng recibo. Kailangan. Kailangan. Okay. Hindi ko kailangan. Nang recibo. I don't need a receipt. Okay. Next one. Malaking regalo. Big present. Hmm. Okay. Malaking regalo. I don't know when can I use this kind of <laughs> this phrase. So strange. Malaking regalo. Okay. Next one. At ito ang regalo mo sa iyong kaarawan. Okay. And this is your birthday present. At ito ang regalo mo sa iyong kaarawan. At ito ang regalo mo sa iyong kaarawan. At ito ang regalo mo sa iyong kaarawan. Kaarawan. At ito ang regalo mo sa iyong kaarawan. Okay, next one. Sa aking ikalawang kaarawan. Ako ay nakatanggap ng staff animal na regalo. Okay. On my second birthday, my present. Oh, okay. It's a gift. Okay, my present was a stuffed animal. Okay. <laughs> Now I I understand regalo is like a gift, like a present. Present. Okay. Sa akin. Ika alawon, kaa araw, kaa rawon, kaa rawon. Ako ay nakatanggap ng staff animal ng regalo. Okay, sa akin ika alawon, kaa arawon. Ako ay nakatanggap ng staff animal sa regalo. Sa aking ikalawang kaarawan, ako ay nakatanggap ng staff animal na regalo. Staff animal na regalo. Sa aking ika, <laughs> sa aking ikalawan, kaa araw, kaa rawan, kaa rawan, ako ay nakatanggap ng staff animal na regalo. Okay, next one. Nagbabayad na customer. Nagbabayad ng customer, paying customer. Okay. Mahalagang customer. Mahalagang customer. 
cost to mayor. Okay, Mahalagang cost to mayor. Important customer. Next one. Ang customer ay bumili ng pagkain gamit ang credit card. The customer is buying groceries with the credit card. Ang customer ay bumili ng pagkain gamit ng credit card. Okay. Next one. Ibalik ang sapatos. Ibalik ang sapatos. Return the shoes. Ibalik ang sapatos. Ibalik ang sapatos. So I think if return is ibalik, maybe can you also use owi, like owi, owi ang sapatos, maybe. Okay, next one. Kailangan ko ba ng resibo para ibalik ang sapatos? Kailangan ko ba ng resibo para ibalik ang sapatos? Uh, do I need a receipt to return these shoes? Kailangan ko ba ang resibo para ibalik ang sapatos? Yeah, very simple sentence. Next one. Bumili ng damit. Bumili ng damit, buying a clothes, okay. Bumili ng pagkain. Bumili ng pagkain, buy food, it's easy. Bumili gamit ang credit card. Buy with the credit card, use credit card to pay, okay. Bumili gamit ng credit card. Ang mag-asawa ay namimili ng damit. Ang mag-asawa ay nagmimili ng damit. The couple is buying clothes. Ang mag-asawa ay namimili ng damit. Okay? Ang mag-asawa ay namili ng damit. Okay, ang mag-asawa ay namili ng damit. Namili. Okay, it's the couple bought clothes. The last sentence is ang mga asawa ay Na mimili ng damit. Na mimili or na mili is different. Na mili is past tense. Na mimili is uh, V I N G, is the present tense. Okay? That's the difference. Next one. Kami ay bumili ng alcohol at pabango sa pamilihan ng duty free sa may pali paran. Okay, very hard. <laughs> Kami ay bumili ng alcohol at pabango sa pamilihan ng duty free sa may pali paran. We will buy duty free alcohol and perfume at the duty free shops in the airport. Kami ay bumili ng alcohol at pabango sa pamilihan ng duty free sa may pali paran. Kami ay bumili ng alcohol at pabang Go sa pamilihan ng duty free sa may paliparan. We'll buy duty free alcohol and perfume at the duty free shops in the airport. Kami ay bumili ng alcohol at pabango. Okay, alcohol at pabango sa pamilihan ng duty free sa may pali. Pardon. Okay, maybe it's the airport. Okay, next one. Ang babae ay bumili ng damit gamit ang credit card. Ang babae ay bumili ng damit gamit ang credit card. The woman is buying clothing with a credit card. It's very simple, easy, simple sentence. Okay, next one. Ang babae ay bumili ng mga pagkain gamit ang credit card. Okay, the woman is buying groceries with the credit card. Ang babae ay bumili ng mga pagkain gamit ang credit card. Okay. Ang babae ay bumili ng mga pagkain gamit ang credit card. Next one. Murang mga salaming pang-araw. Murang mga salamin pang-araw. Cheap sunglasses. Murang mga salaming pang-araw. Salaming pang-araw. Maybe sunglasses. Okay. Murang mga salaming 
pangaraw. Okay. Okay, I will stop here because now the video is already 10 minutes and then I will practice the next sentences in the next video. Maybe I'll upload tomorrow. Okay, thank you for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.